Where are you going? I'm going home. I know breaking up sucks, but you know what's even worse? Wasting a night in New York City. Give it to me, I'm worth it. Let me teach you how to be single. Go get us some drinks. Okay. When you have Rebel Wilson on set, like, really every single take is different. She, you know, offers new new alternatives every single take. And, you know, we shot so much funny stuff with her, we could, like, edit a sequel just of the material we got from this one this one shoot. And so uh, what happens and what the challenge with, with her is that, that you know, sometimes when you when you watch really closely and you, you see scenes with her playing out, you feel like the image starting to shake. And this is because the, the cameraman, you know, was holding the camera and he was starting to giggle. She's great at what she does, but I always was hooked at, uh, you know, by the humor that she also, you know, brings to that part and to everything else she does. And I think she can really, you know, uh, play that muscle in our film. And and at the same time, she's also, you know, just an amazing actress who is very in the moment and can play, you know, very heartfelt scenes too. And who is so, you know, her performances are so honest that I sometimes on set, like literally, you know, I forgot to say cut. I forgot to turn off the cameras because I was just so captivated watching her. We set out to make a film, um, you know, that is very, you know, fresh and very off the moment and a film, you know, for the, today's generation and made by today's generation. And, and we were always aiming for, you know, like some truth. And, and that, you know, it involves comedy a lot. Because I think the best comedy is the one that that you know spirals out of true moments people can relate to, but it also uh, um, it also involves you know moments that are not so funny or maybe like a little bit more um, uh, thoughtful, and and having somebody uh, like Dakota and and also you know our other actress who can pull off both um, brings like a, a a second layer to the film. Alison Brie is the most fun person I think I've ever met. So when she comes to set, everybody gets into a good mood right away because everybody knows because it's going to be a fun scene and it's, you know, really a lot of fun to work with her and because she has such a positive vibe and such a good mood and she's such a, you know, pro actress and and you know knows her knows her comedy and knows her drama and you know knows everything and she's also a very good team player so she can be, you know, very good you know, bouncing off ideas with the other characters and having fun with the girls and also with the guys. And so um, she's, she's just amazing. Dana, who's also the producer, one of the producers, she then was also on set with me, which was amazing because she is so smart and so fast with with comedy and ideas that we were when we were shooting a scene like literally she was like in the back looking at the monitor and rewriting the scene we were just shooting right now and so i did a take i said cut you know and then i hit tick 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 and then dana was behind me she said i had an amazing idea you know and then well, most of the time was really amazing ideas and so uh the, the script changed as we were shooting and she was coming up with with you know great jokes there was always like an undercurrent of, of, you know, what makes people happy. And I think happiness doesn't exclusively come from relationships, but, you know, from friends, from having fun, from finding your place in the world, and so on. And, and I think, you know, the premise of the movie is that when you're single, you actually have time to figure all that other stuff out. And then when you are a happy person and you have found your place in the world, Maybe you find somebody who matches you much better. Is that Tom Hanks from Castaway? <laughs> Seriously, it's like Gandalf is staring right at me. No penis shall pass.